Hey guys, I'm Chris Wanjiro. I'm a fourth year student at Egerton University doing BSc Horticulture and this is what I deal with usually. So these are some of the plants. Uh, we have here Aptinia. This is Aptinia codifolia and this one is um, Tradescantia purpurea. So these are bedding plants and they are used in uh, beds around the houses or in fields. Yes. Um, here we have a pumpkin and the family that are Jesse, but it's affected by powdery mildew and um, zoic virus. Uh, we use this here in Kenya, we eat the leaves and also the fruit. The leaves are eaten in local food known as irio and also eaten as a green with uh, garlic. So yeah, they're beautiful plants and this is what we do. This is nature and we love this. So um, I'm in a kitchen garden right now. And these are the vegetables grown popularly in Kenya. So here we have kills. Uh, it's known as Brassica Leresi, variety Acephala. And here we have uh, Amaranda species. And here we have spinach. So these are grown popularly. And in most homesteads, you'll find them. And there are so many people who grow them on a commercial scale. And yes. All these, they take about three months to grow and about 21 days in the nursery. Uh, they are harvested over a period of time. There are major source of vitamins and minerals in uh, the country. So this will help in fighting food insecurity. So uh, this is our kill. We harvest it from below. And you see, we need a lot of manure to supplement the kills. Yeah, and also artificial fertilizers. But also we do weeding. Here, popularly, we use the Pangas, we like weed like this and remove them. Or you can, if the weeds are not too many, we can remove them with the hands. So before this, we do land preparation with the jambes and the holes, and yeah, that is how we get the vegetables.